Uganda will look to win its first match against Tunisia when both teams clash in a Rugby Africa Gold Cup match at Legends tomorrow. The rugby cranes have previously lost their two test matches against Tunisia. They will, however, start tomorrow's match as odds-on favourites, not least because Tunisia are fielding a weekend side. The second team, uh, the, the most of the guys are uh, uh, 21, 20 years old. Uh, some of them uh, just won the African Cup uh, under 20. Okay. Uh, as I said, our first team uh, refused to come for uh, some issues. And now uh, we try to sort out and I think uh, the first team is going to come back and play the last two games against uh, Zimbabwe and Senegal. A boycott by Cobb's players denied Adrian Bukenya the chance to pit his wits against Tunisia the last time the North Africans faced Uganda in 2009. The former rugby cranes captain expects Tunisia to try and address the issues that have seen them lose two Gold Cup matches on the bounce. Um, rugby is a game of pride and I expect that the Tunisian uh, team will come um, ready to try and avenge some of the very poor uh, results they've been having. Um, they'll be challenged because one, they lost their home first home game to Namibia. They've played at altitude in Nairobi. Uganda is also re relatively high altitude for them. Um, so I think they're going to have a challenge uh, against the, the cranes on Saturday. Really, it's not really about the Tunisians on, on Saturday. It's about how the rugby cranes deal with their first home game in this Africa Gold Cup. Veteran Matthias Ochoa will win his 50th rugby cranes cup playing at Locke. Huka Alex Moviru will also come in for his 25th international cup. Both players are expected to combine at the lineout to try and give Uganda a platform to attack the tourists. Bukenya expects the rugby cranes to leverage on their past two Gold Cup encounters that have seen them pick a draw in Kenya and a win in Senegal. They need to leverage the fact that uh, we are now playing in a significantly challenging uh, environment. The size of the prize on the other side is an opportunity to get into the World Cup qualifiers of next year. And therefore everybody is playing um, like this is a final. Elsewhere in the Gold Cup, log leaders Namibia shall lock horns with Zimbabwe on Saturday as Kenya and Senegal get the weekend off. Tomorrow's match at Legends is expected to kick off at 4.30 p.m. local time.